Hello guys, welcome back to Resident Evil 2. Leon here is a little shaky, but I think he's gonna be alright. This is our inventory right now. And we will be getting into the parking lot. Seems like the horizon is clear. And that's probably not good. We can get back here anytime. Just to briefly check around the place, see if there's anything we can take right away. Yeah, no such luck. Definitely still need a card. Damn. Need a key card. Uh oh. Look look behind. You gotta be kidding me. Get off of me. Stay sharp. Lower it. FBI. Sorry. Thank you. For your help. Surprised you made it this far. FBI, huh? What's going on here? Sorry, that information's classified. Where are you going? Do yourself a favor. Stop asking questions and get the hell out of here. Hey! I'm not done talking to you! That's right. I'm gonna follow her. Where did she go? Uh, if you remember, this this is a door that we weren't able to enter through in the Claire campaign. So, yay, new place. We have a rather respectable amount of uh, ammo right here. We got a map of the area, a lot of places to go to. Um, okay. I'm, yeah, I'm just kind of trying to see... Uh, assess our limits here, because there's... Oh, shit. Can I open this? That was pretty reckless. So, what, what happens when... Zombies are in jail? I mean, how did they get into jail? Who arrested these zombies? I mean, they they must have been bitten and arrested after they were bitten, but because why else? Well, I'm just uh, checking if the doors are sturdy. I guess being zombie is a crime in the city. <laughs> that was not smart. I'm glad it didn't work. I'm guessing that these these guys were bitten and they started showing signs of aggression, so they were arrested. And in their jail cells, they fully transformed. I mean, that's the only explanation I can find. Hello? Hey. I don't believe it. A real human. Yeah, your jailmates are interesting. Hello, human. You been here long? Long enough. Are we the last ones alive? No, no, there's a few of us. Oh, 
That's good news, I guess. Yeah. That's of course Irons sent you. Irons? You mean Chief Irons? Is he still around? Who cares? Hopefully he's somebody's dinner by now. Dude. What do you mean by that? He's the bastard that locked me in here. I'm sure he had a good reason. He did. I was about to blow the whistle on his dirty ass. I'd have done the same thing to him, I guess. Hey, I'll make you a deal. Unlock this cell and I'll give you this. There's no other way out of that parking garage. Believe me. Sorry, I can't do that. I have to talk to the chief first. The chief has an asshole, though. We're both prisoners in the station. So either we play nice and help each other out. Shit. It's coming. What? What's coming? Come on. Come on, don't be an asshole. Hey, you need this. Just get me the fuck out of here. Oh my god. Who is that? It's just me. So I can put that thing away. I, I don't even know what happened. It just happened so quick. I told you to get out of here. You wouldn't want to end up like Ben, would you? You knew him? He was an informant. Had information of use to my investigation. So what he said was true? Hey, you can't keep walking away from me. I don't even know your name. I'm Leon Kennedy. Find a way out, Leon. Before it's too late. Then we'll talk. Name's Ada. Well, I guess the deal's on. Oh my god, Ada is awesome. I gotta say though, this whole Mr. X killing the world, killing the uh, killing Ben scenario, it kind of stopped making sense when you were playing Leon in in the Leon B scenario, if you know what I mean. Oh, we know what to do with the tool, I guess. Memo jail power panel. Uh, the power panel is out. Can the person in charge of it please take care of it ASAP? I assume everyone knows, but since the jail's power panel is old as hell, we're, we're gonna need those custom power panel parts no one makes anymore. There should be a few in the generator room. Addendum. I got word that there's only one of those power panel parts in the generator room. The guy that's here to fix the bell in the clock tower should have another, so someone swipe. I mean, ask him nicely for it, please. So we... One's in the generator room, and the other's in the clock tower. Clock tower is going to be similar to Claire's. Okay, in the... If you're playing this uh, it, as Leon in uh, Leon A scenario, this whole showdown with uh, not really a showdown, just uh, Mr. X killing this person, is kind of the uh, grand introduction of Mr. X. I mean, not really a direct introduction. You don't get to see him. The animation is exactly the same as in here. But there's this. This is the first time he show had any presence in the game, and we are led to believe that there's this unstoppable threat that's just wandering around then we may have to deal with him that was kind of the whole thing so in this scenario though we've already met him we've already had our dealings with him and for Leon to completely be ignorant of what he's talking about it's just it doesn't make a whole lot of sense This door looks locked. Yep. So I guess we're going in here. Maybe grab a drink. Phew. This. I mean, we were here as Claire, so we know what to expect, right? Oh, this place. Right. I remember. Uh, what is this? Item to disposal, key to patrol car. Oh, this is about the, the car key, I remember. 
Do you remember? Okay, we'll use that later. <sighs> Message from Mr. Raccoon. Well, Mr. Raccoon can suck it. <clears throat> I don't plan on indulging him at all. We don't have the diamond key yet. Some ammo here. There's Mr. Raccoon there, I'm gonna ignore, and I think that's it for this room. Well, it seems like this room is a little easier this time. Am I right? Did I miss something? My PS4 just uh, installed Control for me, an upgrade, uh, upgrade to the game. You know what? I haven't played Control yet. Maybe I will one day on this channel. Control is a uh, is a birthday present from a friend. So yeah, I do want to play it. Actually, it was kind of a hand-picked birthday present. I mean. Just, they, they just asked me what game did I want. <laughs> I didn't even consider any other option. They knew that that's what I'd be wanting. I mean, I guess that's uh, one of the advantages of having the gamer as a friend. You, you know exactly what to get them for birthdays. Okay, you know what? This might seem a little cruel. But trust me, this is a worthy investment. Yeah, they are definitely getting out. So I remember Licorice here as, uh, when I was playing as Claire, and at least the, at least no Lakers anymore. Well, I wouldn't completely bet on it. We still got a ways to go. Oh shit. Do you remember this place? I played really lousily uh, in this room last time, so let's try to do better. Uh, once again, I'm gonna start with that one. I don't, I'm not sure if it's going to be exactly the same kind of stuff. Yeah, I did okay. Hey, diamond key. Hey there. Oops. Oh, did I break your rhythm? Oops. <laughs> oh my god, this guy. Wait, 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 wait. I thought I had a thing with me. Okay, okay, that was uh, a little unexpected. I respect that, Mr. Zombie. 
caught me with my pants down. Oh my god. Dude, look at yourself. I get really panicked when, when they are closer to me. Ah, uh, might as well down that in the first place. Wasting all those bullets. But to my, uh, in my defense, they're like really difficult to aim with with the controller when they're getting close. They're like wobbling all over the place. It becomes almost a pure game of chance. But of course, that's uh. Also, out of a lack of appropriate skill. Are you gonna get up? Because I'm ready for you. I don't know why she's always twitching a little and then just... You know what? Just just to be safe. I'm gonna put you back. How, how about that? I don't, I don't believe... Even if she re she's revived, she can get out of there. Uh, what's your story? Oh, he's the guy who's gonna give me some flash grenades. Uh, one of them has bog. Ah, oh, shit. These fallout bugs. Right. Oh, I didn't even really read the autopsy, but that's okay. We got what we came here for. Actually, I think you can also open this part of the room with the tool. We had a tool like that in Resident 1. So do I have... Yeah, I still have the tool. It, it can be used multiple times. Pretty cool. Anything for me? We're already seeing some brand new places here. Oh, this is the generator room. Which means we're gonna find one of the panel parts here. Is that it? I assume this is it. Well, that's... That happens to be our very last inventory slot. So, pretty good luck. Oh, there. I have a feeling we didn't exactly kill every single dog. Because we're not gonna have that much luck. Nope, not in this game. Okay, just combine with it. Oh, you know what? This actually creates an open slot. And we have a respectable amount of. Shotgun shells. I'm a little s afraid to go too fast in this game, which explains my longer than usual playtime. Oh, yeah, we gotta do this. Ah, uh, what, what is it? No, this one goes too far. <laughs> I think you might try. Come on. Okay, here they here they come. Uh oh. What? Oh, this is not going to go well. So did someone 
Oh, I'm definitely glad I killed the old did the dogs in the carnel before. Right. So I don't know if there's shit. Oh, you just try to get here again. Well, that guy is not dead. And I'm assuming there's no liquor in the corridor since they, they've already given me dogs. I mean, they're not going to be that cruel. Right, Capcom? Come on, guys. Oh! Oof. Ah, dogs are too fast. They're, they're, this is supposed to be illegal. Oops. Get away from him. We're still fine. We're fine. Leon's fine. Of course Leon's fine. Have you looked at him? I kind of feel like I'm gushing over Leon's. Oh, well, Leon is a beautiful man. No but, uh, but I feel like I'm like really focusing on that more than I ever did for Claire, which is kind of weird. If you're getting up, get up. Don't do this to me. Don't. Ah, uh, come on. See, see what you made me do? Well, I guess. I guess that's this area. We didn't leave anything. What the heck? Who was making the noise? Well, there is still one place we can go. There is that room with the diamond key, and Claire never had the diamond key. I guess that is... And, I, and I'm assuming Leon's not gonna get all of the keys either. Dude, this is going to be... Something you have to... You can only thoroughly explore most of the things this game has to offer if you, you know... Oh, shit. Well, they can't get to me, not from there. So I'm just gonna ignore them. Oh wait, they, they, they can probably get through the door. Shit. Well, we'll just burn the bridge when we get there, I suppose. Hello. And what do we have? Another roll film. Uh, I don't know what to expect from this one. I suppose... This one probably is going to be a little bit of puzzle stuff. Kind of, hey, find me. I'm on this desk with the toilet on it. Wait, why did I say toilet? What kind of desk has a toilet on them? Oh, no. Shit! Uh, I need I need help, like immediately. I think those zombies are actually after me now, so this is kind of bad. But I am going to grab this. That's for the Matilda. I I don't I think I left the Matilda behind. No, this is the Matilda. Okay. So just to clear space, how about we uh
let's go install that panel we have. Okay, these guys are still safely behind bars. No need to worry them yet. He is still dead. And we need one more of these stuff. I don't suppose this door is open. So for the other electronic part, we need to go back to the station. And how do we go about that? Wait a second. Did I miss that completely? Okay, so we're not gonna be able to get into this room. I guess this is strictly for Claire. But if we go back in here and find the right find the right door, I think we can actually go back to the station. Oh, those guys from the fire range, they're not, they're not gonna come out at me, right? I mean, they're not that smart. I, I, I don't think so. I can't be 100% certain though. Oh boy, look at where we are. Our trusted little safe room. Okay, let's get out of the room. So how are we doing? Do I have my trusted boards with me? I do. And I'm gonna need them. I have a feeling I'm gonna need them. Oh, shoot. I mean, we literally have to shoot them. Holy shit. Do I have a, like a grenade that I can throw? Oh, God damn it. Well, I'm gonna have to uh, use some more of these ammo on you guys. Because I do not have. I don't want to have to deal with it. Deal with them repeatedly. Oh crap! He's fast. Every time I want to go come back to the safe room. It's just not gonna happen. It's really fortunate that these zombies just... They, they just don't know to switch a window. Like the window right next to it also works, but they would, never, they would never understand that. And that is why they will never be us. Yes, among all the other differences, this is the one I picked out. Holy shit, holy shit, holy shit. Okay, it's too late to board the window. So I'm just gonna have to shoot you in the face. Wow, we are just uh, using these shotgun ammo left and right, front and center. Uh, with reckless abandon. But you know what, there's none to it. Oh, I think it's best if we step outside for a minute. Enjoy the fresh air and the rain and the, the fact that there's no zombies here. Which is really nice. A nice change of pace. Oh, uh, the, the helicopter is still burning. So I guess we still need Mr. X to... No, we still... Ha Maybe we still have to put out the fire. Because in, uh, in the Claire campaign, after she put out the fire, uh, Mr. X showed up and all hell broke loose. We still need to solve the safe here. 
Uh, that's the art room. We we are done with the art room. Was there like a liquor that we left in the art room? Oh, I'm so done with art room. Hey, this is a familiar part of the, the police station. And um, this is another safe ha safe room for Claire, but no, we're not getting another safe house, safe room in the same part of the station because oh, we can discard the tool now. It served its purposes and we shall bid it farewell. That means if I Go upstairs again. Uh, I would need to. Uh, the game is gonna ask me to complete the water puzzle again. Kind of weird, but as I said, uh, the, don't don't expect this uh, Leon scenario to be a. Perfect complementary part for Claire's. They are going to contradict each other for many times. The real canon story of exactly who did what is kind of a mixed bag. Hey, did I bring the. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Let's check out this room. By the way, uh, I am not going back to the balcony until after some time because you know what? As long as we are here, uh, as long as we do not do not complete the water puzzle, I'm just going to optimistically assume that Mr. X is not going to sh show up his ugly face and ruin the day for us. Wow, Leon, what the hell is wrong with you? Diamond key. Oh shit. Is this room even like worth getting into after all? Uh, <laughs> nope. As it turns out. But this leads to the main hall. So maybe we can open it from the other side. Ah, look at that. So, still got something out of it. Ah, uh, well, whatever. Um, I'm going to just try to... See, if we don't go to the balcony to, to put the fire... To put the fire out of the helicopter... It would seem like that would not trigger Mr. X. So Mr. X is currently not in the castle, looking for us everywhere like he should. And there's a bit of an advantage to us strategically. That guy. And this guy. Lovely. Uh, you are not coming in, sir. Yeah, he's uh, supposed to be a colleague of Leon's, but nope, he's not getting in. We don't have the heart key. We also don't have this, so I guess these rooms are completely close to us. Huh. Is that, is that right? Is Leon supposed to be this limited? Dude, give up already. As I was saying, Mr. X is not in here right now. So what I'm gonna do is just to take this opportunity and do a bit of a house cleaning. And I'm just gonna go through all the available places in the police station and kill all the enemy I meet. Well, at least to try to do them with... That way... Uh, 
luckily we will be able to clean out at least the great majority of the enemies wait, uh, waiting to assault us. Uh, do we have anything for the portable save photo? No, I don't think so. And we will be able to uh, di dispose of most of the enemies found in the police station. So when Mr. X does turn up, as he must, must, as, as it must do so eventually, because we need to put out a fire in order to get to the clock tower. By that time, I'm hoping that. The station will be a free roam zone and we'll be able to just uh, fly past everywhere do all the puzzles and Mr. X will be just uh, a source of annoyance let's say and not a real hindrance to our progress even though we do have to slow down the progress right now to make that happen is there anything else I can get from the computer uh, probably not. It's a shame that Leon never got to meet Marvin in this scenario. You know what? We kind of got a extra save room here. Which is kind of nice. We yeah. have. Um, not much. Not much. But hey, if I'm just uh, being careful, let's bring another herb. Um, the clock tower is over here. Okay. Just like in the Claire campaign, um, I'm gonna clean out the whole library. Hello. Oh, sorry for disturbing you. But I need to clean this area because I will have to complete this particular puzzle really fast. Wow. Dude. Seriously. That was a shotgun to the head. More than anything else, a shotgun to the head is to make a point. And it was my hope that you would have understood that point. You know what? Let's just uh, prepare for it. Do what we can. Just saves the pressures of few seconds that we're gonna need. That sounds like liquor. Do I have enough ammo to deal with the liquor though? That is the question. Hmm. Let me check out my ammo. Uh I think I'm not gonna do this liquor right now until I have reasonable assurance that I will have enough ammo to do it to clean out the, the, the areas that I'm more likely to trespass because there's gonna be more liquors everywhere <laughs> What is going on? Oh, hey. You 
Oh my god. Oh no! My ammo. What the? Dude, seriously. What the? Okay, this is bad. This is like really bad. Wait, what are you gonna do? Oh, hey. Uh, I guess that's the la the last of the diamond key discarded, and we're going to combine this for some more shotgun ammo, which we're just wasting left and right. But that's okay. That's okay. We're gonna get more. Hey, portable safe. Um, exactly my forte. This is what I'm good at. This is what I'm born to do. Okay. Um. It'll be over in no time. One hour later. See? I told you it was gonna be in no time. Uh, we got a spare key. That's good. Wow, this is like the officially the worst corridor of all time. But you know what? No liquor, no Mr. X. We, uh, we've caught a break from this corridor. Wow, that's just upsetting. So that is the women's locker room. And... This place is still secure. I'm still kind of trepidating in all these familiar places. Because you, you never know what new monsters they have added to the area after we've seen it last. So they're never just completely 100% secure. no zombie from this side there's a liquor right there yep that's gonna be a problem and that's a problem we have to deal with we cannot have a liquor of all things just lurking right outside our door that's not how we do things uh, let's develop the role of film Wait, I didn't take it. Ah, dummy. Oh, third floor locker, DCM. Cool. What we we do have everything. We don't have everything we need. But I pretty much have everything I got. So we're gonna have to take out the liquor with some very limited ammo. You know what? Maybe we don't have to. I have like nine shots, which should be enough theoretically. I just don't know if I'm gonna be very efficient with them. But theoretically, I think we can also Get, if we can get past him and get into the deposit room and use the spare key, we'll be able to get more ammo and then we can come out of the door to deal with him. But that just, just doesn't look possible with him like squatting here with his ass turned against us. Like, look at that ass. That's one fine piece of ass. But there's like a sting sticking out of his butt. It's like, like it hurts. I. The design of this creature is like, I do feel like it's constantly in pain. Oh boy. <laughs> I'm also hearing zombie sound. 
Upstairs? Really? Holy shit, really? Get down. Stay down. I have two shots left. Wow. And I, I don't think I've ever faced the liquor without at least getting a little bit injured yet. Like, I have not mastered how to get around liquors with shotgun. Let's check out what we can get. If we put in two, we'll get this. I think this is uh, fire, pow fire powder. And if we get three, we can get another dagger. And this is for two. Oh, shotgun ammo. I definitely want that. Two or three. I also want extra space, but we don't have two spare keys. So just this once, let's get two, and I think we have one or two, yes. And I think that was 208 with the shotgun ammo. Cool. Oh, we don't have, I don't know if we have enough to complete the mission. The mission being house cleaning. I think that's a bit of a stretch right now. Ah, oh, that goddamn liquor looks still pretty fucking alive. Oh, it's still shaking its head. Are you fucking seriously still alive right now? You know what? I can't. I can't worry about that. Even though he's like right in front of my safe house, I just don't have the energy to deal with this. How's West Office? Is this room clear? Is this secure? No zombies. Well, great. What, where else is there? I guess there's still... There's still this room. Uh, this, this corridor. <laughs> this corridor usually sucks. I don't know if I... Ha I don't know if I want to do that. Because that's usually a harsh corridor. I'm pretty sure there's at least one liquor over there. So what I'm going to do is... Um, where the hell am I? Uh, what I'm gonna do is go upstairs and uh, holy shit, this is just a harrowing side. I'll never get used to it. And oh, he's standing up. Fuck, Fuck me. Uh, I'm gonna go open the locker to see if it has anything really important inside because I really need supplies. Uh. <clears throat> Uh, what was it? Do I have the this DCM? Let's do it. Oh, that's uh not bad. Except uh, these are for semi-automatic. I mean. Not for Matilda. Can I even use this right now? Because I'm positive I don't, I'm not taking it. Do I have a weapon for that kind of ammo? Because I, I have... I pretty much forgot about... It's been a few days since I played this the last time, so... I really... 
don't remember the ammo composition and everything. It's also a problem that we might not have it. We might be completely cleared out by the time. Oh, the lightning hawk. This is the semi auto. This is the semi auto. In that case, I am going to put the M19 back in here for now, just because I have like zero ammo for it. I keep saving the game. Because I, I like had, I'm really worried about what's gonna happen. I'm kind of debating whether I want to explore the last corridor or do I want to go take care of the water puzzle right now? Because we're gonna have at least a bit of minimal ammo up to do that. <clears throat> After Mr. X is activated. Well, as long as we have, we don't have any other enemies yet left. Well, that I think I suppose that's okay, because no amount of ammo is going to do a damn thing against Mr. X anyway. The lack of a heart key is like really seriously impeding our possibility of exploration here. Oh, I have a really bad feeling about this one. He's stuck on the door. I don't think he's dead. I didn't exactly hit him in the head. Okay, maybe he is dead. In that case, okay. Yeah, not much. Not much we can do about him. Except it's still fucking scary. That's, that's like the bigger issue. Really? No liquor? Uh, I don't believe that. Oh shit. What the heck? Where do you even fucking come from? Okay, I'm gonna just blow that guy's head right now. Wow, this is like seriously amazing. Not caution anymore. Uh, better down some pills. Oh, I'm out. I'm out of ammo. Shotgun. Holy shit. I'm just gonna get through this. I have exhausted it all my ammo save for like one bullet in the matilda just to get past this place i'm in like serious fucking trouble right now 
don't have this key. Holy shit. Do you have anything for me? Okay, we are going... Oh, another Laker. We're going to have to fail at this mission of uh, cleaning house. Because that has turned out to be quite a, bu quite a bit of bullshit. And you know what? I'm still alive. So... That's something. That's, let's just get back in here. So the good news is the majority of the police station has been cleaned. For all I know, there are like two zombies and uh, one liquor still, that we still need to deal with. But you know what? Live and let live. Okay, that's not actually what I want, but we're just gonna have to deal with them. Okay, one more zombie that we may still have to deal with. This is getting ridiculous. Holy shit, are you kidding me? How, how are these people just not dead? I mean, they are dead, they're zombies, but they're, they're not dead dead. They're not ideally dead. They're still roaming around. Making life generally difficult for me. Just as a precaution, I'm gonna bring another one set of these. Oh boy, this is bad. We are not progressing. Like I'm going to use the third save slot, to be honest. Maybe there's something back at the... Nope, uh, I don't think so. So, what, what are we gonna do now? What are we gonna do now? I think we have to get upstairs and uh, deal with the water and everything. That guy's an asshole. I mean, I'm wondering, I'm seriously wondering if I'm going to regret this decision of doing all the house cleaning before I trigger Mr. X because the point of doing that is to make it easier for myself. Now I'm just seriously wondering if that I, if I made it anything any easier. Uh, I don't suppose there's anything to take from here. I hope we can get some more uh, things from the balcony. Okay, a blue herb is, is acceptable. I'll accept that. Oh, man. Oh, I won't even be, I won't even be able to go back that way. Come on. This game is pounding my ass. And I don't suppose this will work miraculously. Nope. Well, get get a shower, get some water on your face, cool your heads. The cooler heads will prevail. Oh. I put a fucking handgun that can use this ammo back at the safe house. Oh my god, what a dumbass. Why did I do that? Maybe I should just reload. Uh, do I want to reload? I do want to reload and start again from the safe house. It isn't very far, but you know what? I made a decision. I made a wrong decision. Uh, I'm gonna have to deal with these consequences. Ooh.
<laughs> nope. guys you guys this is like seriously not cool right now I want to be able to get into that room because if you remember Claire in Claire's campaign that door was locked oh no 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 get up here get up here I want you to come up here I want you to come get me come on you see how cute I am? See how good looking I am? I will be delicious. Come get me. Yes. I'm a walking happy meal here. Wait, 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 wait. You, you seriously don't want to bite at me. Come on. Come on. Come on. I know you like me. I'm popular. I'm Leon as fucking Kennedy. Whoa, 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 guys. What the fuck? Just won't take the beta out because if they're up here, it'll be easier to get around them. But can I tell you, they're just smart. This is gonna be a bit of a problem. Yep. So. Now if I get over there, I'm, we're gonna have to deal with Mr. X. <laughs> you know what? Just, just, just let me through, just let me through, okay? Ammo, 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 please, please tell me there's ammo here. What, what was that? Okay. But if I combine with that, it's going to make more handgun ammo I think which I can't use oh oh thank god there's a it's a safe house it's a safe room that's great and like, we got a key we don't have room for the key but we can deal with it. okay the lightning hall goes back for a second take the M19 out Uh, as much as I suck at this, I don't think we're going to need three sets of herbs at the same time. Shotgun is going to stay with me because I'm afraid. Just the sight of it gives me some reassurance. And... Yeah, I think I'm going to have to like take whatever ammo I can get. Oh, it's actually for the Matilda. So I could have used them, huh? Someone lose a key. Cute, give me that. Okay, let's be save the game again. So wow. We can't just ignore everything and and just deal with Mr. X. We still gotta explore new rooms. Rooms that were previously stopped by the what is it? The club key. Okay. God damn it. You can't get in here, buddy. This is my safe room. This is the rule. have to come back here I just have a feeling that I'm gonna have to come back here so I need to clean the path and to clear the path and uh, wow I can't believe I'm actually doing this I really don't want to do this hey more herbs oh 
Okay, lay it at me. There. Uh, can't go up this time, so I'm just gonna have to go down. See, this is why I had to clear a path. Oh, the lady zombie's still alive. That's charming. Not. <laughs> Mr. Zombie's alive too. What the zombie just don't fucking die in this version? Let's save it again. Why not? Th this whole playthrough is gonna be called a thousand saves. Well, you should watch me play Fallout. Or Zelda, you know, just Breath of the Wild. It's really going to be a, a new save file every freaking second. Um, nope. Can I just... Can you just fucking die already? I think I'm gonna be back here, so what the heck. You know, I was wondering, like, where would I get a tool to do the library trick. But now that I have a new key, I guess it's in one of the rooms this key opens. So the age-old question is, where do we go? Where do we go first? Where do we go first? Seriously. With a club key, where can we go? Nowhere that is stopped by the heart. That's for sure. So, first of all, record room. Does anyone see anything else? Uh, yo, I welcome anyone to share. They're seeing something I'm not seeing. But from what I'm seeing... It seems like... Can it be? It seems like the... There, there's only one room with the, the club key can open and there's the records room. But that's not true, is it? I do remember another one. Huh, that's weird. Uh, what about that room where there was a mirror at the middle? What, what was the room called? I do think it's somewhere in here. I'm spending a lot of time. Oh, the, this is it. The interrogation room, observation room is now marked. Because, uh, because I never even tried to open one of these doors. Okay. Uh, it's on the... It's downstairs, so I'm just gonna go downstairs. It's taking me longer than I should to... read the map. Considering I should be fairly familiar with everything right now. Like, I've been through all of this stuff. Uh, I hate it when this happens. Hmm. How do I even get here? You know what? I think I can only access that part of the station from upstairs instead of downstairs. Wow, the geography of this police station is just nuts. How do people get around? I mean. This is a police station and efficiency should be 
a matter of concern, but you know what? It was a library before, so maybe that's why. I mean, not library. It was a museum before. And maybe in a museum, they just intentionally made things a little creepy, a little cryptic. I guess that's possible. What is the architectural standard for a museum layout anyway? I, I don't know. I don't hear him. That's that's good sign. As good as I can hope for. So I, I definitely feel like the... Am I going the right way? I think I am. I definitely feel like the enemies in the B scenario is a little harder. Okay, like a lot harder. They take more ammo to take down than... There's, there's a more of a chance for them to get back up. Hello. Almost missed ya. Oh, so I'm not gonna have to meet another liquor in here. Good. Hey. What do we have here? Oh, man. Don't worry, guys. I'll be able to solve this in no time. I really did solve this in no time. Hey. Okay, good thing I don't have to deal with the liquor anymore. What do you have for me? Uh, can't use it. Not yet. What is this? Um, did I read this as Claire? Oh, this is for one of the lockers. So we got more things to explore, obviously. Holy shit. I hear him. But you know what? Hearing him doesn't mean he's actually that close. I don't know what I can do if he gets into this room. Can he get into this room? I kind of have to wonder. I mean, he can't open this door. It's locked. Oh, shit. If he gets into this room, is he going to vault through this? Because I kind of want to see that. They almost like, man, I am a handsome man. I don't suppose you can open the door from this side. Why would I? I'd rather that door stay locked. You know what? I'm going to try it. What the heck? Nope, but at least uh, I, I would have that marked on my map. Just to not to create any future confusions is still worth it. So we got a few more places to go. We need... Uh, well, we just need to go back to the west side of the station. What else can we still do? Um, the, the safe in the waiting room, we still don't know the password. Maybe we never will. Maybe that's... Maybe I missed something. Maybe I didn't. You never really know. Because neither Leon nor Claire is supposed to single-handedly be able to figure out everything in the station. And that's like one of the coolest things about this game. You really need to explore it as two persons. Even though you have to do some of things, okay, a lot of things in the same way. That's still pretty cool that a game keeps you guessing like that. Where is he? Where is he? I don't know. I don't see him. Don't I don't want I don't dare to run. Ah, uh, where, where do I go first? Uh, let's see here. Library. Don't have the tool yet. 
I need to get to the records room. Ugh. You know what? Save the deposit room first. It's closer to the safe house and we can also get an uh, inventory expansion there, which I sorely need. I'm always in need of that. See, I don't know, maybe it's just a personal play style. I, I, when, whenever I play almost any video game, I get in trouble with the inventory limit. That happens to me in Bethesda RPGs like Fallout or any similar game like that, like the, the Outer Worlds. I had that problem with... We had problems with uh, weight management. Like, not body weight management, although I do have body weight man management troubles with... Oh, I shouldn't have gone into the library. Ah, oh, shit, that wasn't... But you know what, this is okay, we, we can just this solve the, the locker room thing while we're at it I think I hear him behind me but you know what that could just be my hallucination I'm just a little terrified with that so recently I've been playing uh, outside of playing this game I've been playing Breath of the Wild on my own and I know I know what Finally? Yeah. But that that is a game that most people have played a long time ago, like pretty much as soon as it came out. But for me it's like Wait, the I've already completed this one. So what is, what was that for? Oh, it's for the waiting room. I freaking walked past it. God damn it. I'm just gonna have to seize some kind of opportunity to go back to the waiting room. Even though I haven't really accomplished anything between this and the last save, I'm gonna save again. So, when I was playing Breath of the Wild, I was just dying to get more uh, get more slots to put my weapons. And it's not like I was very successful in expanding them. I did expand a few slots as long as you find the the guy who trades you with co trades corrupt seeds. Uh, I don't remember his name. Okay, first of all, I think we can open two o three. Was there something in one o three again? Yes, the dagger. Good. He sounds so close to me. Oh god. Is he getting in here? I mean, if he's getting here, I can just go around him with that. That's like no biggie. I just saved the idea that he's so close. Gave me this sweet extra space. And yeah, whenever I play anything like Elder Scroll or Fallout, I end up just putting everything in my pocket and get overcumbered. Did you freaking see that? <laughs> wow. Where did he go? What the heck is that sound? Is he stepping a human skull? Okay, where do I go? How do I go to the records room? Um...
I can go this way again. Oh, I hate, I hate this. I hate so, I hate this so much. And we do have to go through more zombies if we go this way. So maybe go back to the main hall through the west office. We still I can hear him. Wow, there are zombies actually still walking in here. I'm impressed, dude. I'm impressed. Like, respect. Oh, holy. Nope, 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 nope. Uh, you're not gonna get me here. You're not gonna get me here because you can't get in here. Guess what, dude? You have your limits. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Stare down, bro. Or dance off. I'm just gonna wait for that sweet sound of him opening a door or something. You know what? Let's save again. We made some progress. We, we got extra space for the bag. So that's worth a save. Just to celebrate. him all the extra work I did was to was so I could have a free police station to myself when I have to explore it uh, while Mr. X is chasing me all around the place that plan did not work as well as I thought, as I hoped. But you know what? It's still. I think it's still worth doing, just so we can have the amount of peace and quiet we enjoy right now. Oh, I think he is on his way. Quickly explore this place. Yes, find the tool. Good. Oh, we have ammo. Well, cl close to it. Um, we can also discard this. You know what? I think I'm gonna keep these gunpowder just in case they can be used better in the future. The records room is still red. I wonder why that is. What have I missed? Ah, grenade. I'm glad I picked you up. We're not going to be... Oh, shoot. You can't see me. You can't see me. Oh, it's you. I want to go back actually. I don't know if Mr. X is like actually on this on his way over here. But I want to go to, back to the waiting room just to that guy is seriously annoying. Shit. Oh my god. That came out of nowhere.
You know what? I'm weirdly not that afraid. Now that I know he's up behind there chasing me, it's... Oh, how did I miss that? It's usually just the uh, unknown that's really scary. Besides, he can't get me here. Yes, yeah, suck it! Unless you want to try this little hole yourself, you're welcome, by the way. Um, where do we want to go? Right now I want to go to the library and the waiting room. Not this way. This is not where I want to go. Whoopsie! It's just the hiding the way the safe room for a while. Okay, that was eventful. We have the tool now. You know what, I'm just gonna be a little greedy. I'm gonna bring all of this stuff with me for the moment. I'm not expecting to pick up a lot of new things right now. I mean, we're gonna be able to get something from the safe in the waiting room, but that's just one thing. Or maybe we just don't need both of them, so I'm gonna store one of them. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god, did that just fucking really happen? Holy shit! That was an epic fail, but it was worth it. Was he fucking waiting for me? Oh, the liquor is still twitching. Did he go upstairs or what? Not sure. I don't want to stay here and find out. All I know is he's definitely in this part of the room. I have two herbs. Now I can easily load the last save and uh, just skip that unfortunate part. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna stick with it. It was my mistake. I'm gonna keep the consequences with me. <laughs> Even though it hurts like hell. I hear his footsteps again. You, Are you fucking kidding me with this? Dude, this is like freaking trolling right now. You know what? I've come to the same conclusion that I did as Claire. You cannot live in fear. You cannot just always hide from your problems. You cannot always run from it. You can temporarily, but that's not a solid solution. So I'm just go Where am I going? Where the fuck am I going? My god, these people did, whose life I have touched. Wow. I've heard, I've read, I think I've read somewhere that when you hear his footsteps stop, that's where you really, like, really need to be careful. 
Okay, hit me. What is the combination? Uh, it's gonna be left six, right two, left eleven. Left six, right two, left eleven. Left six, right two, left eleven. Oh shit. Yep, I fucked up. This is a thing for the Matilda. Okay, now I need to go back to the library. This is a bad idea. I don't I shouldn't be going this way. He is definitely somewhere here. Leon, dude, I know this is hard. This is a lot to ask for after what I put you through, but uh, can you just groan a little less loudly? Uh, uh, if he's in the library, I'm going to... Well, I'm going to turn around and run. What else, what else am I going to do? Uh, Aha, I don't think he's here. Uh, Which means I may have time to do exactly uh, this. Was that loud? That was probably loud. Oh, I just need to hold this. Hang on a minute. I feel like he's like at the door, but maybe that's just in my mind. One more go. One more and we are a go. There we go. Leon is getting his uniform messed up on his first day on the job. Okay, that went really well. Why is this challenger... You know what? I don't have time to worry about that. Definitely on his way. But you know what? Uh, like the last time, I don't think he can get in here. <clears throat> Repair plan due uh, location PlayStation West side of the clock tower. Due to the high cultural value of the bell, I'm calling a specialist in to make the repairs. We'll go over the details once they are on the scene, but in the meantime, I'll take steps to secure the bell since the yoke is threatening to break. Cool. Does anyone have the wheel? I just realized I don't have the wheel. Can I get the wheel somewhere here? So I definitely still need the box. That much has not changed. Now, right now this looks very identical to Claire's part to me, which is really bad because I don't have the wheel. 
I was like expecting something in here to be different so I can solve the puzzle in a different way. <clears throat> Gunpowder large. What are you gonna make? Oh, okay. That's also pretty good. Oh, this is a bit of a problem. How are we supposed to do this without a wheel? No, nah, we, we are not going to do this without a wheel. There's definitely going to be a wheel needed somewhere. I, I'm wondering, do we really need mixed herb with three greens? Because I know that is a, like maximum healing effort, but... I, I always feel like, at least on a normal difficulty, it always feels like two is quite enough to regenerate from whatever danger you're in. Hmm. That was uh, that was a bit problematic. Being unable to complete the clock tower puzzle and all. Where did Claire get the wheel again? Try to open this door from this side. Yes, uh, we can. Um, uh, it's not in here, is it? Fuck that guy. Oh my god, it's right there. It's literally right fucking here. Oh, Mr. X is down there. Well, that settles it. He can't fucking fly up here, even if he wants to. And he can't get into the cloud tower, so fuck you, Mr. X. You know what would have been really annoying if I had found out about the wheel and just didn't have enough space to carry it. That would have been like really, that would have royally pissed me off. Yeah, Mr. X is on this floor now. Congratulations, you have achieved nothing. I got a small one too. How do we do this again? Put the big one here. Okay. Ah, down your puzzle and give me the goodies. Hope I don't have to write a report on this. Hmm. 
No, I don't think you do. I mean, we're gonna report it too. Where's the thing? There we go. Another electronic part. Do you have a better name for it? A power pedal part. Good. I knew you had a better name. Okay, we got everything we need. We just need to go back to jail and uh, start a zombie prison riot. Because nothing could possibly go wrong from there. So guys, thank you so much for watching. This has been a slow episode, so I'm going to stop it right here. Now, off the screen, all I'm gonna do is just to find the closest to safe house and save the game for the bazillionth time. And um, we are going to go back to do the jail riot thing in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you then. Holy shit. <laughs>